you would call him, people would say that he's, um, what's the word, ruthless, um, power hungry, but he's a capitalist and he understands the way I see him, I don't see him as a bad guy. I see him as a guy who has to make tough decisions and everybody else is too sentimental to do that. So when I play a character, I'm not playing good or bad, I'm, I'm playing the person under those conditions, you know. So tell the truth under imaginary circumstances. So I, I see him as a, as a hero. You know, yeah, and it's, you know what? It's a good role. It looks like a lot of fun to play, especially in this. Yeah, I mean, you know, I have my issues with uh, certain aspects of it because I uh, this is the first time I've seen it. It takes me about three times to watch something to just get over myself. <laughs> but uh, you know, I I just I like playing a guy who's not killing people in real life or a murderer, or a thug. You know, I I like playing someone with intellect. Even if he's a bad guy, at least he's a smart bad guy, like an Ozark. You know. Right. He was a cartel guy, but he wasn't just your average thug. He was a brilliant guy. So on Mars, it's a different kind. Is it just fit? It's 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 gangster, but it's corporate gangster. It's a whole other thing. Exactly. These guys wear suits and ties. It's a white they, collar. Yeah, that's right. But <laughs> white collar people can sometimes do more damage than any uh, any thug ever can. Exactly. And last question. This show is really gonna. I'm hoping that it will get kids interested in STEM, more into the sciences and technology. What do you think kids are going to take out of this uh, Mars show? Imagination, putting themselves in the place of these astronauts. I mean, kids have always been uh, fascinated with astronauts and you know space travel, time travel, anything that's out of the ordinary. And this show is out of the ordinary, and it it really puts so much production value. You really feel like you're on another planet, and oh my God, what what to do if this or that happens? You know, this is what it's all about. I think kids will be uh, entertained and 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 uh, inspired more than anything, and not let science or uh, you know astrophysics get be too mysterious for them. Hopefully, it'll whet their appetites. Exactly. Well, thank you very much. It's always great talking to you. Thank you for watching, Muse. If you like what you saw, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click on all the other videos you see to watch more of our content.